Hey folks, welcome back to Total War Rome 2. Um, uh, we left off with a secession, uh, got distracted fighting the Romans, they, Tarchunans and the Aerati managed to take a few provinces and that caused some distress among my parties and so now we are at war with our own faction. Before we get too far in, uh, let me know in the comments down below whether or not you want to see an uh, Alexandrian campaign, whether it be Rome 1 or Rome 2 mod. If you let me know, I'll do it. I'm planning on either doing that or the Hannibal at the Gates campaign next because we're going through the entire Total War Corpus from uh, Pharaoh all the way to Follow the Samurai. So let me know what I should do next, whether I should just skip the Alexander campaigns or should continue them. Now then, we take it. We have taken VSOL last turn. I'm going to delete these two units. We do not need them breaking down our in economy, and we're going to need to recruit more troops in order to take on uh, these rebellions, and then uh, almost certainly the Romans again. All, the gods and your All right. Um. I need to find... I need to recruit another agent is what I need to do. Okay, I'm gonna send him into the Luzna. Um, as for this army... I'm gonna recruit some Umbrian Spears and a couple more Slinger units. That should be all... Yeah, that's all I can recruit. This army... Pretty elite Axemen. I'm going to recruit some Spearmen in it. Actually, take that back. I'm going to recruit two units of Spears... Uh, four units of skirmishers. They're significantly more expensive than the slingers, but they do a he heck of a lot better job. Um, and scrap all of that because I want to do that while I am going up to Sarcina so this army can focus on these two provinces. So let's recruit that now. That is going to pretty much cripple our economy by next turn. But we'll just have to see what I can do. Um, the Secessionist army is attacking this province, and there's not much I can do, really. They have more troops than I do. Their army's not the weakest because I made it myself. So he's just got to kind of let them do that, unfortunately. No, send an army up there to fight them eventually. Uh, Selbios. Selbios. Okay, yeah. Uh, ba -ba. Let's get him a bard. It's in the turn. Okay, the Sessionists are not attacking for some reason. Uh, embrace the Greeks. Infantry armor improved. Sweet. Um. You know, we haven't started this at all. Let's get logistics and get some extra campaign movement speed. Oh, uh. uh I think I hit spacebar or something to cause it to go really fast. Okay, that will have we'll have Sarcina next turn. Okay, let's send this agent in over here. They should have a full stack, which is yeah, why I need to just keep recruiting here. Uh hmm, let's get some more young swords, I suppose. It's a good life. <coughs> One more unit of spearmen. Okay, um... So what I'm gonna do... Instead of just waiting on... Instead of just waiting on this army to finish recruiting, I'm going to move this army up... And we'll be able to 
uh, attack that with both armies next turn. There we go. And that'll give us a good invading force, and we'll take back Velizna. Uh, and yeah, we're going to lose Oskela. I, I regret that, but there's nothing I can do. I don't think sallying out is a good idea. Um, I'll have one more turn. But I'm going to be significantly weakened by that point. Um, I'm significantly weakened now. There's no point in inviting destruction on myself. Let's do ambushing and let's get warrior in the turn. The Insubrays want military access. Give us your gold. What if I do a defensive alliance with you two? Sweet. Okay, so I don't have to worry right now. I think we have some spare. Okay, Illyria, sure. Okay, so the Insubrays are weak. I just realized that, but there, again, there's nothing I can do about it. Um. So let's go ahead and take Velizna. Oh, let them cower before us. Yep, that's just not going to do it on its we own. The for the tribe. But this might. For on the move, lads. Auto resolve. Kill them. We're going to raid it, even though we probably won't be able to take it that turn after doing that. We need the extra income. Let's go ahead and raise it then, I guess. Okay, um, now with that done, let's disband these units and get our economy back on track. Velizna, Velizna, whatever you're called, let's build a warrior's, uh, let's build a recruitment center there. Um, this army, uh, we need to recruit something. Let's recruit some more... What we're going to do is we're going to recruit some more native Etruscan spearmen into this army. Let's go ahead and take Sarcina. Let's auto-resolve. Impressive stance. Like that. Sack it. Raise it. Okay, we're doing good on a income right now. Let's get a Warrior's Lodge and repair the uh, main building. Okay. Yeah, they're gonna take Oskela next turn. Again, it can't really be helped. Um, should send you out to take Pisa to keep them from uh, gathering too many forces. Oh, got the hiccups. Let's recruit a horse, or build a horse pin there. Give us the ability to recruit horses. Okay, now that I need to turn to politics. Because, unfortunately, that was not the only province which I had to worry about. But I can't... Or province. That wasn't the only party I had to worry about. But I can't do anything about that until I take Aeratim. And I can't do that until I... Uh take Pisa and Luna, because I want to get rid of this secession uh, as quickly as I can. In fact, what I might just need to do is just... Oh yeah, I don't have anything here I can recruit with. I'll just wait. Go ahead and build a farm too. We'll wait for that to finish building, recruit some more young swords in it, and then we'll go and attract, try and attack Aeratim that way. Um... Goal is murder to us all! I can go ahead and delete this unit, too. Rome has... It automatically has some of the best units. Which is great. 
Let's get a meeting hall and a meeting ground here. I also love how even after converting it, you can't convert the Capitoline Hill so the rest of the city is still Roman. It's cool. Uh, I just think it's interesting. Okay, let's go check out what the they are doing. Or the they army. This is Roman Light, Hoplites, and Swordsmen. Resting. Okay, let's go ahead and end the turn. Uh, I'm going to just skip that edict because we need to use the remaining edict we have. Can no, I'm not spare? attacking the Venetti. We need to use our remaining edict on the um yeah popular surrenders on this province they can't take flothry right can they they shouldn't be able to how to resolve Raise it, or sack it, then raise it. Ta-da, we've got Pisa now. Um, I should go ahead and repair buildings there. Let's get a, well, actually, yeah, you're already Gallic. But let's go ahead and get, you know, I was right, let's do that, and then a well, because we're going to need to rebuild the public order here. Okay, um, so Askela is probably going to turn into their new capital. I mean, it's... I don't foresee them being able to take another province uh, real quick. As the secessionist, I don't remember being super aggressive. I might be wrong about that. But if not, that'll give us a few opportunities. And that may just be wish casting on my part. Um... <laughs> So yeah, we'll try and get up to the Noble Gallic Swordsman on this. Be good. I just love that this is my garrison automatically, like right off the bat. Uh, and that'll give us... This will give us a good recruitment pull in Rome itself. Um... Unfortunately, I do not have a stable to build or recruit cavalry or other. I should probably try and get that with crop rotation next. So that'll be my next research. Um, I don't like doing this, but the Northern Front is getting pretty sketchy with... The Helvetti and Sinone's secessionists up north. So I'm going to recruit another army. Um, I guess it's going to have to be Clan of the Moon, which I don't like, but we can only do what we can do. Um, put them in Rotovium, start recruiting some young swords, build a meeting ground. That'll give us some Gallic Spearmen. Give us an edge to take on those troops up here. Um, we'll t finish taking Luna. Then I want to figure out what to do from there. I'm going to go ahead and move this army into Beasel. And in the turn. We all look forward okay. to seeing your leaders strangled. Very, very. Well, that helps determine what I am going to do. Okay, Placentia. It's under siege. Where's Placentia? Okay. Um... That's not great. Not, That's not good at all, actually. Let's go ahead and take Luna. We're going to have a rebellion here in a turn or two. 
Uh, and let's move this army in to Pisa. Okay. Um, the people of gold. What? Warriors all. Going to move this army north so that we can use these two armies to take a air team and be able to uh, make the clan of the moon like us again. Let's go ahead and build a horse pen. Recruit more young swords. Uh, Sononi secessionists already have rebels, which is kind of funny. Um, ready for battle. I can recruit. So I'm gonna wait, actually. Hold on. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and recruit one unit of young swords to replace those nat native Latin spearmen because they're not good. They're bad troops. Okay, it's in the turn. Okay, this. So I was entirely wrong. The are, or Sinone, the secessionists are going to keep on moving toward my lands. Unfortunately, not a whole lot can be done about it until I get some more troops recruited. Um. You look. Uh, I'm going to eat the treasures. I need income. Constant game I'm playing. Let's attack Luna. Auto resolve. We'll sack it, then raise it. Gives us a little bit of income. Um, okay. Let's uh, begin researching crop rotation. Only one turn, dang. They're making short work of us. Okay, so in Pisa. Let's go ahead and attack this army. Um, I need to keep recruiting here, but I am running out of money and troops to recruit that are any good. Only one more turn until that's unlocked and I can just start recruiting some garlic, spe garlic spearmen. Let's go ahead and delete these units and just fill the rest of the ranks with some young swords. Okay, um. Honor to gods and your ancestors! That gives me a pretty good army to defend Rome with. Especially with that garrison. Okay, um, with that being the case, I'm going to take a risk, move this army up, and we're going to attack with these two armies since that one is occupied chasing down <coughs> the separatists. Ready for orders. Go ahead and delete this unit, get that income too. Let's end the turn. Uh, yeah, edict. Can't help it right now. Gosh, the Venetti are strong. That is a that is a huge problem.
okay. Huh? Fine. Release the captives. Okay. So let's attack with this army. Continue siege. Fruit mercenaries. Move in to help. Get moving. Let's auto resolve. Sack it. And then that'll have us. Once we do that, we'll be able to do the edict, party loyalty, which will prevent us from having another secession in the immediate future. Delete those mercenaries. Um, but uh, let's get a craftsman house going and a communal ground. Let's repair that. Okay. I need to still build in Luna, apparently. Let's get an Artisan's Lodging Repair, Repair, Attack this army. Auto-resolve it. Release the captives. Okay. Um... It is not worth chasing that army all over creation. So I'm going to take this army up and we're going to start trying to stop the Veneti invasion. Okay, so I can recruit better troops here now. And Albingonum and Asta is going to be taken before I can recruit cavalry, which is very unfortunate for me. But it is what it is. I'm going to fill up the rest of my ranks with spearmen. It gives me a relatively strong army to be able to move against them with. This army, I'm going to recruit some more young swords. And I'm just going to end the turn because that's all I have the money for. I issued the edict. Was there another edict I could have issued? Dang. Um, okay. Let's do a tribute collection. And then, oh, I've still got more edict. What the heck? Um, <laughs> tribute collection. And armies I've got to take care of. There we go. Warrior. Let's get some subtraction on that upkeep. Let's get despoil. Let's end the turn. They are going to take Asta. There's not much I can do about that. In fact, there's nothing I can do about that, so I'm just going to let them take it, and then I'm going to move in with the other army. Or at least that's going to be what I'm going to try to do. Gosh, this is getting sketchy. That's new. Somebody inciting rebellions in my provinces. Okay. I get all of that tribute collection and okay. Okay. Um Well then. Let's go ahead and get on the attack against Asta. Before their garrison has a time to replenish. Let's move this army north. We th I think that this army will be sufficient to take on the Sinone Separatist. So I'm going to move this, these two armies in sync with each other. Or in unison with each other. Um, I need to figure out what to do with this army too. We're going to keep our campaign on Rome going with these two armies. And that'll give us a good force to take Vey with. <coughs> 
Then we could take Ostia with this army. It'll work out. Okay. Um, okay, let's end the turn. They're, they're, they're bugged out. Okay. They're going to attack Harmony. Okay, so... Let's go ahead and attack Asta. Let's auto-resolve this. There's no point in... I know y'all... Y'all wouldn't... You know what? Actually, I... Let's fight this battle. Um, it'll be more fun to fight. Give us something to actually Hi. want. Let's start deployment. Figure, yeah, the balance of power is not as much in our favor once we get on the battlefield. Um, which is okay, because we've got elite units this time around, and they really don't. So we'll put some young swords. I say elite. Uh, we've got some line infantry, pretty much. And they've just got uh, line infantry to militia. For, so, yeah. Sling shots, let's go ahead and put you in the rear cavalry let's just do a normal line i don't think they're going to come out and attack me no they're not let's move, or, let's move the whole line forward okay so this will be the only battle I fought in, fought in uh, on the battlefield against the secessionists, which is cool. Slingers, open fire on those young swords. Go ahead and pull the entire line of slingers forward so that y'all have a better line of sight. Because it looks like they're going to hold their slingers back for some reason. And I can and maybe able to use this to draw out attention or, or draw them out of their city and become the defender myself. Taking care of the cavalry pretty good. Doing the same thing on the spearmen, or swordsmen, I mean. Tribalist spearmen are heading forward to take the place of the swordsmen. That is fine. They are they have no shields. Yeah, we're just ripping through them. Uh, you two units, go ahead and attack those slingers. As for the rest of you, you fire on these young swords now. <coughs> I mean, this is not necessarily the prettiest battle, the way to do a battle. Uh, but I'll take the free kills. OK, 
Okay, you three, go ahead and fire on them. Fire on those young swords. Oh, they're they're entirely destroyed. Wow. Uh, some more tribeless spearmen are showing up. Let's go ahead and just open fire on them. Man, I wish the Sinones could have had blue. The blue's really sick. Okay, uh, they're starting to waver. They're going to retreat here in just a minute. Just like that. Beautiful. Okay, is that the Noble Swords? No. The Noble Swords are going to be the general units. They're probably hiding back here. So have you changed fire on against these units? Or this unit? Actually, you know what? Go ahead and fire against that unit because it has exposed its flank to us. Except for you two. Let's go ahead and take that Slinger out. They are not going to let us just sit there and pepper that unit. So let's go ahead and fire down on this one. Actually, let's just keep. Oops. Let's just keep it to those four units and keep firing on this one. Just like that. Fire on this unit. And we're about to be able to we're about to have to charge in, but I am ecstatic with how many we've taken how many we've killed with just our slingers. One of our units has used all its ammunition. One more volley. One of our there units we go. Has used all its ammunition. They just sat there and let me do it, so we've got a good uh, shot of getting much fewer casualties now. There we go. That's beautiful. Those young swords charging in. Yeah, they're not gonna hold out. Let's go ahead and get our spearmen prepared. Let's move our general, since he's our only cavalry unit, 
around the rear. See if we can't do anything uh, that way. The Dalek Spearmen are... So they're medium troops, right? Oh, they're light spears. So I guess we don't technically have much in the way of medium uh, troops, do we? Our X-Men would probably be light. Huh. Because, uh, we go straight from light to heavy with our generals. Or our noble sword swords. Don't crash on me. Not after that beautiful display by our slingers. Take on those tribalist warriors. Oh, this is absolutely beautiful. We're just cutting through them. I mean, this is astounding how well we're doing. But they didn't use their slingers like they should have. So we were able to cut through a lot of their troops before we even got into combat. Let's go ahead and pull up spearmen around who fill in this gap we've created for ourselves. Um, let's move you into the city. There's the general. Which is, yeah, uh, oh, he's only medium. Interesting. So, we are much lighter in, uh, our ability to, or our armor capabilities than the, uh, rest of the world. The rest of the map is. That is so interesting. Looks like the, his general is just going to stand there, so we're going to do a frenzied charge into his back. Okay, that got us a few kills. Let's go ahead and pull our general out of the city. It was worth a shot just trying to get who or kill his general, but we ended up killing uh, about 25 of his men, and we only lost one man, so that's well worth it. Okay, now the real fighting set in. But even this, we're winning pretty handily. Warriors of gold. Let's go ahead and move this unit over here and take on those tribeless warriors. There's no point in just letting them sit there whenever they've got a general, technically. I guess it's just a captain, but still, it'll give a little bit of a morality buff, I think. They're going to try and send in their tribalist spears against us, I think. Go ahead and charge into their tribalist warriors. Like that. <laughs> that ought to have us. There we go. The unit is broken. Does it do anything? Just says friends routing, okay. Come 
mean, we were just cutting through them. Like, that is almost an entirely a sea of blue. Take out that skirmisher unit. You have our spears. Goals. We lost more to their slingers than I would have liked. This, you, these units are not doing great because of the fact that they are fighting on a superior unit. I was getting them engaged with the general in order to try and move my uh, general around to flank him, but he's busy getting his butt whipped by slingers. Battle is turning in our favor. Spear! Yeah, I handed them some free kills by charging those spearmen in this early. Come on, break. Okay, they broke. Let's move our cav back out of the battle. Go ahead and move you there, around there. Just like that. <laughs> okay, that's the battle. Sweet. Decisive victory. Only lost 600 men. Killed 3,000. That is a good... Battle for us. Uh, the Sinone Secessionists should be taken care of pretty much by now. Let's sack it. Raise it. Repair it. Whoops. Oh, dang it. Uh, farm. Uh, sacred enclosure. Well, repair. There we go. Okay, let's move these armies up to Parmney. This is going to be a sketchy war with the Veneti. They are pretty strong. Uh, probably stronger than we can field against them. But we're just counting on our ability to be better than them. And after all, it's not like I started the war they did, and then I'm just trying to finish it. Okay, so... Ooh, where is the angry... Who... who why? Angry bull clan? Why is that a thing? Okay, who... Who... Rudos? Am I, am I gonna have to kill Rudos? Rudolf? Rudos. Mm, uh... Okay, at the very least, you don't get to hold on to Rome. I live to serve my people. Like, no. Um... Have a character assassinated. 
Okay, he's traveling. But I will try and get the Angry Bull Clan taken care of, because that's going to cause us to have civil war in, like, one turn. That's, that's ridiculous. Oh, I've got an edict here now. Um, let's do tribute collection, as always. Okay, so they're gonna take it. Nothing I can really do. Let's just let them have it. No, I'm not We've joining war against the Illyrians. The Rudos has returned. Rebellion imminent in Sabina. Well, that's fine. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is it's time to move against the Romans again. Let's not call our allies. Let's just get to uh, war on. Get it. Get to war against them. Take Ostia. Osteoporosis will be ours. Attack it. To serve my people. Let them cower before our strength. We're gonna raise it and then uh, rebuild it as we always do. Can I finish my wine? Um. Mm -hmm. And move in with this army. And we're gonna use Brennus as reinforcements. Auto resolve. It. And we're gonna have to wait to raise it until next turn. Okay, um, let's have you move up to Verkellum and then we're gonna take Oskella back. These two armies are in for a bad time. They've got three armies just sitting there. Okay. We're going to need to start recruiting an Araminium. Um, and in order to f help fund this, let's go ahead and build a Craftsman House. We'll recruit a few units of Gallic Axes. Um... We're not going to be, be able to win a battle outright, so let's see where they can get to. This army can get to right there. We can get to right here. They see us, undoubtedly, because we're not in ambush stance, so let's move in. And then we'll see what we can do that way. Okay, let's... Uh, you issue an edict, invade, or roam rather, tribute collection, and let's start handing out skills. Soldier, let's decrease our upkeep, give warrior, there we go, end the turn. They're going to attack Spalidium, which is okay. I'm going to move Brennus around to defend, help defend Spalidium. 
Let's just auto resolve this. There's no point in really fighting any of these battles right now. They're just too elite. They're not even that elite troops. They just they they have so many. They've got so many. Hey, secession uh, should only be up here. Yeah. Cool. Oh. Let's just auto resolve this. It. Raise it. Uh, build. What did I just get notification of? Increase in rank. Okay. Okay, let's do the thing we did over here before with they again. Move you back up to the city of Rome. Move. You down, attack this, auto resolve. <clears throat> this time, let's make they ours. After doing the sacking. Actually, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to move this army north against the cures with Brennus. And we're going to sack this as well. And kind of start pincer maneuvering this army here. Okay, let's build a sacred enclosure and repair and a well. Move you in to be closer to help out. Thirsty for battle. Okay. So I'm going to move you here. On the move, lads. Fortify. Defending our move you right behind him and fortify. Get moving! Get the stakes up! And that way, live to serve the people of Gaul. you are both within reinforcement range of each other and stand a better chance at beating the enemy. Okay. The Insubris are attacking Flacentia. Hopefully they get it. I, I know that was mine before. But I'm gonna have my hands full over here. Brennus has. Okay, we've got three generals with skill points. Um. <laughs> let's get strategist. And then in the men here, men, let's get soldier. And then in the men of Moravan, Moravan, whatever it is. Let's get Soldier, and let's end the turn. Okay, the Veneti are going to move closer to our land, or move in deeper into our lands. Again, there's not anything I can really do about this right now. Uh, I will take a peace treaty with the right to you. Thank you. Rebellion and they. Where the heck is they? Okay, yeah, that's fine. Oh, and I forgot to do this. Let's do a craftsman house. Duh. 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 Wait, and uh, duh. And I'm going to need... 
take some land to just make up for what I just did. Auto resolve. Attack. I live to serve my people. Raise. There we go. Okay. Um, let's take back harmony, I guess. They've got a pretty decent force, but with our combined force, I don't think they'll be able to win. You have further orders. There we go. I was right about that. Let's go ahead and auto resolve and get rid of this army. Sack it. And we'll raise it. Actually, let's liberate it because we need the freedom to move more than we do the province right now. Okay, let's move this army westward against Eperidia. What we're gonna do... Is we're gonna move this army north, attack the, rebe battle. the rebels. Leave none alive! We'll release the captives to give us a, give ourselves an income bonus. Move back into Vey. Um, and then we're gonna start moving down to Roma and taking these provinces. Uh, Brennus. I could do this little maneuver right here. No, I can't. Okay, we're, we'll move Brennus uh, nowhere because this army will just take back that. So we're just gonna take that back. Main. So we're going to need to get rid of this army. Like that. Release captives. Move Brennus over to Rate. And then we'll take up this army. And that should free up a force where we can move it up to help out against the Venetti. Um, I live to serve the people these two armies are just going to need to sit here for a turn. We're going to be able to take Epridia next turn and Oskella in the few turns after that. And that'll get us back on more solid ground once we have the secession taken care of. In the turn... Oh, edicts. Edicts, edicts, edicts. Um... Where? Where can I do an edict? Not there. Not there. Not there. Ah, uh, here. Right? Yeah, here. Okay, well, let's do a tribute collection again. I'm just needing money. And then I need to do all of the skill points again. The spoil. Uh, stalwart defenders. And let's get soldier. This is the turn. The Sam Knights want a trade agreement. Yes, I would love friendly relations. Okay, the Venetti have managed to push back the Insubreeze, which isn't great for us, if I'm going to be honest. Uh, young Blood, recruit them. Crop rotation, sweet. Surrender intimate and uh, Spaletium, but... 
That's all fine and well because we can move these two armies up to help now. Get moving. Can I finish Just like this. Today is a good day to die. And they're going to retreat because they are cowards who don't want to fight on uh, the soil they chose. So I'll resolve this battle, get rid of this rebellion. Release captives. And move you to take on the Roman army. Get rid of them. So. Whoa. Okay, this is good. We can move this army north now. Which is what I've been needing to do anyways. Move you up to Sarcina. Move Brennus back south to Cures. Um, and then move the, the army invade down to Rome to defend against this army. Um, over to the west, the northwest, let's go ahead and take Eperidia. Whatever it's called, I really don't care. I'm just ready to get rid of this, uh, these rebels. Sack it. Raise it. Repair it. Okay. Stuff is starting to look more normal. Um, so... Since... You're gonna think I'm crazy. You, if y'all were me, you would might try and head back south and uh, to take on the Veneti here. I'm leaving that to these two armies, because um, even though... The Venetti are a imminent threat down there. I'm going to need to take them on the offensive a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to begin moving these two armies against uh, Placentia and pick up where the Ensebris left off. This time with a much stronger force than the Ensebris had. Um, as for research. Let's get we sack, which gives us a lot extra, a lot of extra income from battle and looting settlements. They may try and take May. I don't think they can quite reach it though, so. We should be okay. They can reach cures, probably. We'll just have to see what they do. No point in talking about what might happen whenever I can just end the turn and see what will. Suardra. As you request. Despoil. There we go. Yeah, they're trying to move to cures, which could work in my favor because I could... <clears throat> okay. Well, that changes things a little bit. Oh, I'm at war with the Raiti again? Really? Our generals are eager to attack these people. Uh, rebel army. Okay, fine, whatever. Give culprit to the Carthaginians. Enemy joins my faction. Okay, this is this is uh, I, okay. That's enough slices. This is what we're gonna do. Move this army here. Move this army against this army after these two meet, and there we go. Auto resolve. Release the captives. Gives us 1,100 wealth. Move. Brennus nowhere because he can't move. Hopefully he doesn't get ambushed. Okay. So. This is bad. But I honestly think I can make this work. 
I'm going to go ahead and keep this army moving the direction it was going. And I'm going to attack. Yeah, that's... Okay. So, they, that's what I was thinking. They do outnumber us, but we have significantly better quality troops, so we can just auto-resolve and take care of them. Sweet. Release captives. That gets rid of that army for now. Okay. Um, we're gonna try and take Placentia again. What I need to do is I need to move this army to Verkelum. Keep them from taking this since it's now the northwesternmost province. Or northernmost province, I guess, not northwestern. Um, I don't need to split up my armies. I'm going to continue with the offensive because I think this army down wherever she is down here can take Kaisina and Ravenna maybe meet us up there. So we're going to move you up to Brixia. And they may try to take Placentia this turn, which would actually work out, because uh, them doing that would mean that we would uh, be involved, and I'm actually help happy to help them out here. They're not going to be able to take Verkellum now, because I moved that army over there. Um, I'm going to move this army south next turn to take the to take an Inogni. First, let's move a scout out to just make sure that there's no other armies sitting down there. I don't think there will be. I think we've beaten the Romans. For all intents and purposes. I'm done. Ready for battle. So that means I can move you back to Thaletium. We can take on this rebel army. In the turn, Sorikio. Good job, man. On the turn. The vanity are trying to slow us down. But they can't stop us now. I had to change the tune of that to a terrible tune after I realized that that's copyrighted. Auto resolve. Bam. Beautiful. The Veneti have lost that province. Let's release the captives. Oh, they've not lost the province. They're going to leave it to us? Okay. I'll take free loot. The Raiti want peace, and they're going to offer us money this time. The Sabines want peace. I'll take it. Cheap infantry. Sweet. Um, I can't really attack with this army right now just because of the way things are, but let's go ahead and take this. Uh, the garrison's not weakened, unfortunately. It replenished all the way, somehow. But we can just sack it and raise it again. For the tribe. Raise it. Okay, we have our provinces back, except for Parmni, which we kind of sacrificed. Um, let's replenish here. Rebuild this province. They cannot take Rotovium. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move you north and start taking... We're trying to take Oskella. And I'm going to actually see, since the Raiti offered me peace, if I can get more out of them. So, you have come. Uh... Let us hear what you have to say, then. Do we even share... We do not share bonds with them. How unfortunate. Okay, never mind that. I was going to try and see if I could eventually confederate with them, but that's just not an option. Um, let's move up to Sarcina, take back Kaisina, and then we'll move up to Ravenna. As for this army, oh, well, I was right. There wasn't another force 
but I need to go ahead and take this with this army so that the Sidonis don't take it where I can. Uh, let's continue siege. Let's move this army down to help. Strike them down. And before long, we should be rid of the Romans entirely, which is good because they are actually an extremely difficult threat to face. Um, because they have actually pretty elite units right now, which is terrible for us. So let's sack it, raise it, and it's ours. Okay, let's begin rebuilding. Craftsman House, Sacred Enclosure, Commons. There we go. Um, if the Sam Knights don't take it, I will take Fregale next turn. We should be able to hold uh, Rotovium and Asta against this puny army. Move up to Ascala, and that'll give us another front if the Ray T get uh, too anxious to cross paths, with, cross swords with us again. The gods and your ancestors. <sighs> But I think that we should end here soon. Um, what I'm going to do, I'll probably end after taking Kaisina back. Let's get to spoil and end the turn. Sweet. I'll take two wounded in agents and one in turn. Favor from Carthage. Sweet. These are all good things. And the Romans are destroyed. So we can officially cross that off of our uh, list for victory conditions. Nice, nice, okay. Um, I'm going to leave this army down here and move, the, move Brennus back to Rome. And we're going to start rebuilding, er, building up Rome here uh, to give us some more income and stuff like that. Where did the Volsky? That sounds familiar. Oh! The Romans had a rebellion. That's that's funny. A rebellion killed the Romans. Or maybe it wasn't a rebellion. Maybe it was the Samnites uh, creating a client state. Whatever it is, I am happy that it worked out that way. Let's go ahead and force march to Kaisina and move this Great army in to actually take the action we take this settlement for the drive auto resolve aggressive stance there we go Icena is now rightfully back in our control sack raise there we go Ooh. let's get uh farm built so we can recruit cavalry there again after having been attacked from the Veneti that makes me realize I do need to upgrade aluminium but that will wait until later um for now I think we are good to in the video. Okay, so I may have messed up. <laughs> for battle. Uh, for battle. I may have made a mistake, but that'll be a problem for future me. 
currently is trying to get to the point where I can end the video and I'm just sitting here looking at all these. So yeah, let's end the video here. Make sure you like, subscribe, do all the th things cool kids do nowadays, and I will talk with y'all later. Make sure you let me know about that Alexander campaign down below, and I will see y'all later. Bye.